Hello, hello. My name is Christina Zachary with the Zachary team brokered by Keller Williams Portfolio. My husband and I are here today to show you a brand new listing that we have. It's gorgeous and stunning and you don't want to miss it. It's double the lot double the home yes you have two homes you have this beautiful home that you see right behind me and then right behind this one is a beautiful casita you don't want to miss it so stay tuned and also we are basically close to the heart of downtown so it's in a great location we all know real estate's location 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 so stay tuned for the video there's a lot you don't want to miss so this house before we get started it's 1314 square feet that's including the square footage of this home and the one behind us the casita this one is going to be three bed one bath and then we have a one bedroom one bath behind us so great lucrative opportunities here if you all wanting to get into investments or if you're into investments already or if you need a mother's quarter or if you need a guest quarter there's so much to see i'm keeping y'all waiting Let's go ahead and go inside and check it out. Already coming through the front door, you can already tell this home has been well taken care of. And let me tell y'all, this home has been extensively renovated. Like I mentioned, it has a wonderful space and it's just wonderful as soon as you walk in. So let's get started. Right when you walk in, you're gonna have this really good space. I love how cozy it is. And you have a great invitation to the home with this living room and dining room combo. Beautiful fixtures, as you can see above me. I love how it has a sort of feminine feel, but you could still kind of add a masculine touch in this if you wanted to. So beautiful light color. Colors. I love how they have this place, but I can just imagine a family here watching TV on a weekend or like I said, we're in close to the heart of downtown. So this is in a wonderful location. So stay tuned in a few minutes. I'm going to tell you guys a little bit where we're, where we're situated and how close we are to some of the really cool things that San Antonio has to offer off to the left. Come on, check out this first bedroom with me. I like how they kind of showed that this could be an office space, but it could be a kid's bedroom. And I like how it faces the front of the home, has plenty of light, but it still has enough shade during the day because we know sometimes it gets hot in San Antonio. It's gonna have a good and ample shade throughout the day just in case. So that room's not gonna get too warm. Coming to the second bedroom, I really like the sizes of all of these bedrooms. They have great space. They have great, just I'm gonna say it because I'm a woman, right? They have great energy to it. So as we walk in here, it's about the same size as the front bedroom, but it's a different, it's situated in a different part of the home. So it has a different vibe, has a different mood. But as you can see, this can also be situated, situated as an office. If you are into house hacking, right? If you live in one home and you want to rent out the other, this is great for you. This is a great option. So you could have people just staying here with you, uh, family, friends, and you can also have a rental opportunity in the back, but stay tuned for that. We're going to get to the master now. I like the size of this master, especially it's when you look at homes downtown, sometimes they can be a bit small, but this one's actually a decent size. Just want to, I want to tell that to y'all and express it to y'all, especially when we come to the bathroom, y'all have to check out this bathroom. I absolutely adore the walk-in shower. I also like that there's no carpet throughout the home. It has an individual sink, but it has plenty of storage space. So even, if you have a lot of clothes, you have places to place them. You have a lot of makeup, you have places to store it. Or if you have a lot of shoes like me, you still have that option. Coming this way, one of my favorite parts of this home is the kitchen. And one of the most, most favorite parts, in my opinion, is this gorgeous chandelier. I just love how it truly encapsulates the energy and the beauty that this home has to offer. You have quartz countertops, you have a eat-in breakfast spot, you have a built-in microwave oven, large, large sink, you have a adorable, adorable window just above the sink so you can kind of see some greenery that the sellers have put there. Lots of upper cabinets and lower cabinets. Wonderful gas stove over here. Plenty of space for a fridge as well. So it's a very good, flowing kitchen if I do say so myself. My husband agrees. I don't do a lot of the cooking he does, but that's what he said, so I'm going off of what he said. I really also, right, because we're in Texas. Sometimes we need pantries because we have a lot of food. So here is plenty of storage for that food just in case you need that extra space. Coming this way, we're going to check out the bathroom that is situated to the left. So I like this bathroom. I like how it has the tub shower combo. So just in case someone does like taking baths, they have that opportunity in here. 
Great space. I like how it's basically from floor to ceiling. You do have some storage options and you do have a little bit of natural light into the bathroom as well. Here's the spot for the washer and dryer. It can be stackable, but you can also put in shelves of your own to kind of have that extra storage space for some cleaning items. Let's head outside. Y'all know me, I love a good covered back porch. Come in this way. We have sidewalks and I just wanna talk and spend a little bit of time out here talking about the potentialness I just made up my own word, <laughs> the potentialness of the opportunities that are created in this backyard. So you have an extended driveway. So if you guys want a house hack, you can live in this one, rent this one out, or you can rent both out. And you can definitely get into that short-term rental situation, if you know what I mean. And let me tell you about all the potentials that you have here, okay? So you could have a basketball court here so you can have multitude of cars just being able to park in this spot but you can also have an opportunity where people who want to be outside they want to have a good time playing basketball you have that opportunity right here let's say there's a lot of dog lovers here in san antonio there's a lot of dog parks and perhaps you want your own space for your own little pups and your own little little fur friends you can have a gate built here have a space for the dogs, have a beautiful little entertainment section for them. And I love this part. I love Texas. I love a good outdoor pit for grilling situations. This can be partying. Can you imagine at night when it's just middle of summer and it's a cool night and you have the lights up and you have parties going on and people just coming around. You have neighbors, friends, colleagues just coming to enjoy your house and your investment that you just put a lot of love into so have them come on over sit around a warm fire they can go in and have some food and they can check out the size of your cute little pantry that you have there they can check out the size of your master bathroom downtown and you have this beautiful casita right here i think there's a ton of potential here i think if more trees are built you could also have a canopy tour situation cover this there's so much potential for outdoor entertainment. So if you are wanting to move to San Antonio and you love the outdoors, this is the perfect listing for you to check out and purchase. Check out this casita, come on in. I love a good casita and I think this casita is absolutely wonderful. It's very mindful, very demure, very cutesy. <laughs> so I like how they just equipped everything in here to be a great space. You have a nice kind of sort of half mini fridge right there, a beautiful size table that fits so they can show you how all of this space can still work with a casita type situation. So if you have a mother-in-law and she needs her own mother-in-law suite, if you have a friend that needs a place to stay for a little bit, if you have a short-term rental situation, I think this is a great spot, especially with the location. So it's not just great for y'all, if you live here for the location, but anybody who stays here, it's a great location for them too. Stay tuned to the end of the video because I'm gonna talk all about the location and all the greatness of the location of this house. But let's check out this bedroom in the casita. Great size window unit just above it so you'll make sure and ensure it's going to be nice and cozy and cool and comfortable and very demure. You will also notice that it has, it's own electrical panel and you might have guessed it already but yes each house runs on its own gas and electrical meters so that's a pretty cool little option for y'all if y'all want a life hack sorry house hack <laughs> one thing i really like about this casita in this one bedroom is it has a good amount of closet space they did not spare no expense get it because they just announced the new jurassic park movie Okay, sorry. Coming into the bathroom, great size again. You have that tub shower combo as well. And I like from the tub to the ceiling, you have the tiles. Again, no carpets in here. Also, let me mention no HOA, so you don't have to deal with that downtown. Beautiful sink. I love the natural light coming in from that little window. And you're thinking, do I have to share my laundry from my main home? No, you do not. You have a stackable washer and dryer here option as well. So they can do their own laundry. So you don't have to worry about it and neither do they. Now let's go outside. I don't think I really fully have grasped just how long the driveway is. So let's go check that out real quick. Check this out. I don't have to step in any grass. I can just come out 
of my little rental. Just imagine, I'm a little person who was like, hey, I wanna come to San Antonio and visit. I need an Airbnb. I rented this one out. And now I don't have to step in any grass, go into my car. Such a great mindful landlord and rental owner. I love it. See, I'm still walking. That's how long this driveway is. And you can fit two cars here, you can fit two cars there. I'm telling y'all, it can fit at least eight cars, six big cars. Just telling y'all. Also, y'all have the option, right, to put a carport. You don't have to be in the sun if you don't want to. Take that option. Build a carport. And you have an electrical gate. Doesn't get better than that, I'm telling y'all. I've been telling y'all, let's stay tuned for the location, 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 because it is in a great location. And I'm gonna tell y'all all about it right now. Now, I do have my phone in front of me because there's a lot of numbers and I don't wanna steer y'all the wrong way. So stay tuned with me right now. Okay, so we are close to the heart of downtown and I love this location because most of the items, or items, or the locations or things that you would really want to do in San Antonio, are downtown and downtown is literally let me make sure i get it right downtown san antonio is 10 minutes away and the tower of americas is seven minutes away if y'all don't know what the tower of americas is it's the really tall tower and you can see for miles and miles around you can actually see it from here as well if gabriel my husband as always who's always behind the camera everybody say hi to my husband gabriel he's behind the camera and the briscoe art museum is I was about to say six minutes, it is eight minutes away. You're four minutes from the Alamo Dome. So, if people wanna come here, and it's also six minutes from the Frost Bake Center driving. So if you have people who come here specifically for a show, for an entertainment, for something in the theater, something in the museum, something in the Frost Bank Center, or the Alamo Dome, or the Henry B. Gonzalez Convention Center, this is where they're gonna wanna stay because the Uber is not gonna be that expensive, the drive is not gonna be that far, they're gonna be in close distance and in close proximity to where they're actually staying. And another thing I wanted to point out was the San Antonio Zoo. Let's say you have a family who's visiting and you want the family wants to go out and have fun. The zoo is 10 minutes away. And let me tell y'all, Brackenridge Park is also an amazing park here. And if you're coming, for an event, like at the convention center, you have a convention to go to or a conference. Let's say you're a golfer. Golfer is not, golf is not far away from here. You can golf at Brackenridge Park as well. It's the Brackenridge Golf Course, and that is also 10 minutes away. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to, I didn't want to steal y'all wrong, I'm telling you. Now, another really cool thing is this Airbnb, this, this listing is super close to Fort Sam Houston. So if you have a military family, this is Military City USA. We absolutely support military. So you are not that far from Fort Sam Houston, which is 12 minutes away. Another great thing about this location is, man, well, okay, great, Christina. We're super close to downtown, but what if we wanna go to the Rim or the Quarry or Stone Oak area or Chavano Park area? Well, let me tell you. Y'all are super close to Highway 35. Highway 37 are literally five minutes away. 281 is about seven minutes away. I-10 is about six minutes away. So any other major highway, Loop 410, Loop 604, you can take those four major highways to get to 604, 410, which are just loops around San Antonio. So let me tell ya, this home has a casita in it, which is very desirable downtown. Also, great short-term rental opportunities here sit in front of you. So please come check out this listing, come check out all it has to offer and just see the potential that it has. If y'all have any questions, you can get in touch with my husband and I, Gabriel and Christina Zachary with the Zachary team at 210-504-5301. If you guys have any specific questions, if you wanna check it out online, it's 1006 Center. So thank you so much for watching. We will see you guys later on the next video.